I think we're in luck today, boys. I think I got a 10 foot rim with nobody in it. The downtown rec where it's like a recreation, it's not an LA fitness. Super pumped. I just don't know if they allow filming in there, so I might not film the warm up. But Holy let's get it. Shit. Just walked into heaven. This is actually the old magic gym, old magic practice gym. Check it out. I've been here a bunch, but I've never vlogged it, so it's a dope gym. It's close to my place, and it's like a rec center, so it's not really memberships, and it's for a lot of schools come here, but when it's like school time, it's empty during the day. Woo! Too perfect. You can't ask for better than this. <sighs> when that first jump is real, it's gonna be a good day. Gotta make sure to warm up, especially when I'm hype and there's no one here to play with. Gotta warm up properly. Just under 10 feet, so like 9, 11 and a half. I think I'll call that 10 feet. My body feels better than it has in a while. I think it's the lifting and the good stretching and the taking it easy when I need to. Pumped up my, oh, pumped up my ball, super bouncy. It's a little hard, so it might be hard to catch and things like that. It might rim out easy, but I'd rather have it over pumped and under pumped because a higher toss helps me jump better than a low toss rim like this. So if you have an over pumped ball, it's better so you can go for high tosses. Even if you can't get it, it keeps your jump form better, at least for me. straight up not the best finish but you know I feel on point today I don't feel like a hundred crazy percent meaning like extreme fire running through my blood but I think those days only come when you have the high highest jumping day you've had since your career whatever you mean meaning like a higher jumping day than you ever ever had I can barely talk but I'm definitely jumping well feel good ready to get going warm-ups almost over CJ, hurry up. I'm almost at my peak. Come on. Ah. Ah. You good, bro? Try to punch that fuck. I'm jumping well, but nothing. Oh yeah. Oh, let's go. Oh yeah. Oh, let's go. <sighs> Not the cleanest finish, but I punched it. I wish it went boom. I think I need to kill that cleaner. I had a lot of room to spare. Just want you to know I'm getting hype. Not a soul in this place, screaming by myself. Some weird squeal came from like deep within. Oh! 
Here! Look at this place! Look at him go! Woo! Look at this place, see? I got no. lost! Lost? Oh! There was no chance I was getting that yet, I got close. Just so you need, whoa, just so you know, I'm a little bit on the downhill. Like I feel like I'm at my peak, but I'm a, like it's getting a little bit harder to jump 100%. It's not effortless anymore, but I'm gonna jump a ton because it's my full jump day, and I'm talking into my camera with people watching. It's beautiful. Teach me. Damn. Damn. Oh. What? Oh yeah. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Puts the headphones in and kills it. Oh. I talk too much, so he put the headphones in. to do just get it to the rim Awful. pretty dead but it's my full jump day so I'm gonna try to get out of a dribble dunk push myself to pass exhaustion about practice I'm just trying to be a good friend you want to do the same? yeah Woo! 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 Oh, my dead legs. got me hyped that's really good practice thank you C it's a big tip pro tip what do we call it dunk tip dunk tip actually life tip really yeah 
put an obstacle in front of you and then go over it. It helps my form a lot because I know where he can jump, so I have to try to go really high, so I take off quick, so I go straight up. When I'm not, I think too much of like trying to get to the rim. I just take off better when someone's there. I guess I want to dunk on people. Man, a life tip. Stretching, he thought I was talking about stretching. That is a life tip. Come on, Steven, get up, go! Oh! Dead legs. Those ain't no dead legs, you got this. Let's go, get up, get up, get up! Great day, great day today. Glad I wasn't alone. CJ, thank you for coming. If you're watching this, I appreciate it. Or if you're sitting right next to me, thanks. Some of my highest jumps, I still was kind of uncoordinated on some of the tricks and stuff like that, but I felt like I was finally jumping hard and like higher than I was. It really took 100% effort and feeling like this to be able to jump that high. So I'm looking forward to the next dunk sessions. I'm taking the weekend off, maybe dunk Sunday, but overall really good. Uh, dribble dunk was really good at the end. I think I already mentioned to put an obstacle there. I had a lot of dribble dunks. They all were just a little bit off, so I'm happy with that. My vert, my standing vert and my dribble dunks felt like they got lower and worse. I think that's because I got a little weaker, but I think hitting the weights will help that again. But my max jumps felt super high. Possibly my best windmill on 10 feet, 9, 11 and a half, and possibly my best backboard attempt. That one was crazy, but I missed it. And decent East Bay attempt. I'm happy with that to the rim. Uh, transfer I got it to the rim that's all I wanted to do today because I was I just had really bad technique but I'll go to a low rim I should murder it and then get my technique up but dribble dunks are starting to feel good I'm starting to feel real jumps and I'm almost to getting them to 100% of jumping I still have some weird jumps where I jump forwards but I'm getting it down I'm almost like young CJ the ball was really good great first day with the new ball loved it super bouncy uh, let's freaking get it dunk life for life all life what is this guy doing here <laughs> The Golden Bear came Did for I a solo just, session. Did I just walk up on a vlog? He just, just walked <laughs> into this. What's hey, going on, bud? Nothing, man. A little sweaty 